5.88, good morning. It's uh, actually afternoon, 12.24 p.m. Been up for a little bit now. Um, mom and sister are at a soccer tournament thing in Dayton, Ohio, which if you don't know is way down south of Columbus, uh, a little north of Cincinnati still. But Yeah, so they're there, so it's my job to come out and, uh, and water some flowers and stuff so they don't die. And uh, I'm gonna do that. And check this out, we got these blooming. I believe these are Rose of Sharon's. We got some huge bees in here for frig's sake. Look at that. Bumblebee getting its nectar fill for the day. Toke up, bud. I also have to get the mail. It's all these fun jobs that, that I usually don't do, but now I get to, and it is a gorgeous day. Check this out. It's just about 84 degrees right now. It's going to 90. Uh, so we're gonna hit the pool big times. And I don't think I have any yards. Actually, that one needs to be cut. I'll do that this week. But that one's good. I did it last week. Mine looks excellent. And uh, they still owe me from last time. So maybe I'll stop by and see if I can collect. Look at all of this crap that us and everybody across the country gets every day. You know what? All of this, everything in here, can be done on an iPad using no paper, no time to physically distribute goods, to physically make things that are only relevant for a day or so. Ugh, I will never get a newspaper and I hope to never get anything in the mail except packages. It is kind of nice having the whole garage to myself because it means I can do that. Which looks absolutely ridiculous. There we go, that's better. It's now uh, 5.07 and we went to the pool for a couple hours, which was nice, and I didn't film that. How bad is my hair? Eh, good enough. And I'm going to dinner now. It's my grandfather's birthday today, July 22nd, 1925, actually. He's 87 years old today. Happy birthday. So we're going out to dinner, just basic in town. We were gonna go to, um, to Rosewood Grill, which is a little nicer, but she doesn't wanna go for some reason. So uh, he brought up the good old yours truly, so that's where we're going again. Better than Perkins, right? So we're gonna go do that. <clears throat> I've got plenty of time to get there, so we'll go through town and see if uh, see if there's anything nice out, and I'll talk to you in a bit. Yeah, an APR Audi TT slash R8. Got my typical parking spot back there, all the way back in the corner because I beat him. Now it's time to get a table because I beat him. Looks like they took the good car out tonight. There they are in the Genesis. 7.48 p.m. Hey. hey! Biking time. It's uncomfortable biking weather. I'm sure you disagree. I think it's, I hear so much it's, it's like 90. It's miserable. And we rode into the wind the whole way. Now, Taylor left at 7.36. It's 7.48. He's 12 minutes out. We said it should take six minutes. The wind is pushing him here. How is it taking him this long? It's ridiculous. Aside from that, it is a pretty night. Uh, it's, it's just too hot and humid, but we got some great music over here. Check it out. We're gonna film them later. Your favorite? Better than, uh, better than anything else, right? Yep. You made it. 749. How was the ride? Yeah. It's a little too hot for biking, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. I didn't even hear that. You didn't hear it? Well, they're just phenomenal. You know that song? Uh, night talking with BGs? Night fever with BGs. Yeah, you're thinking of Jive talking. No, it's, it's night fever. Looks like Tim's got the Ferrari out tonight. For the 430 Scuderia again. We're gonna fuel up here at Shell and uh, maybe we'll go find it. <laughs> Trying to film a clip, and you're saying that? I'm right. Uh, yeah, but you don't say that. What? All right, so I just missed it, but that 4:30 went by again, and uh, that. What do you think, Taylor? Worst sounding prairie they've ever made? It's not. It's pretty bad. It's pretty terrible. The yeah, 4 4:30 has always been. <laughs> I, I'm looking over there, and so you're probably like, "What the hell? Why are you looking?" Kind of. Somebody just got out of that limo to buy yogurt. Oh. Uh -huh. Yeah, in, in Hudson, people get limos to buy yogurt, I guess. All right, so we each got this uh, brisk, what is it, strawberry melon. It's really good. And um, we're just reading the nutrition facts on the back, and mine has 19 grams of uh, sugars. This should be the same, right? It should be the same. It's the same product. This has 26. I, I see that the label's different. Go back to the front. Mine has pink, and yours has green. And they have kind of a different logo. So you got more sugar. Congratulations. 
How does that make you feel? Better than you. Okay. Open your open your mouth. No. All right. It's like a product placement here for brisk. Do it again. You want to do it on camera? Oh, oh. <laughs> Taylor. There are a lot of people here for a pretty mediocre showing tonight. Mediocre is being generous. No, they're better than what we usually have. Better than I think. the Pop-Tarts. Better than the Pop-Tarts. No uh, they have popcorn for sale. Oh, suck it, Mark. What? Oh, I'm giving birth. Explain why you're in pain. I had like a liter of this kiwi strawberry. He had it too. We filmed the it earlier. Strawberry melon. And it just hit the stomach, like now. <laughs> so you're giving birth to strawberry melon. I can't even compress my stomach anymore. It's filled. Oh. oh. Taylor's crowning over here. He says he's about to give birth still. So we're in the bumpiest route possible to find a bathroom. Any better? Yeah. You're dilated three inches now, right? It's not good. It's pretty bad. <laughs> Freaking rights. We took the uh, Area 51 road down here now. How you doing? Good. Dilated, okay. dilated to a foot, right? <laughs> That's as far down as we're gonna go. It's huge. Here comes the Hogwarts Express. <laughs> oh boy. See if he shines his horn. Yeah, maybe he will shine his horn. <laughs> Yep. That's all marijuana, boys! Yeah, buddy! A homegrown hemp! It's finished! Bye bye! Bye! It looks like your legs have been already run over. How do you bend your knees like that? <laughs> In all seriousness, Taylor. <laughs> how do you do that? How the hell? That just looks really painful. The train's coming. I'm putting the camera down put the here. Don't get too dicked. Ryan, did you put it? Did yeah, the dime's on it. Here, put it near the camera. It is not melted. There it is. You guys made it. You made it. Freaking rights. <laughs>